Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another synthetic wig review, but it's not just any wig review because I am collaborating with my girl Nizzy, aka Nizzy's Playhouse. She is bomb. I love that girl. Her content is amazing. Her makeup looks, I'm like, girl, teach me. And she slays every wig that she wears, short, long, curly, straight, colored, natural. I'm here for it. You guys will love her channel. If you guys are not familiar, y'all need to get familiar. And if you are coming from Nizzy's channel, hey girl, what's up? How you doing? So yeah, we are both going to be featuring this wig right here. This is Janet Collections D and I have it in a color number two. She's going to be looking so good in her. So make sure after you finish watching this video, you head on over and show her some love and tell her that I sent you and I just want to say a big thank you to Nizzy for collaborating with me on this video. If you guys don't know, I have already reviewed this wig before in a different color. I had the Balayage 30 and y'all really seem to love that video and I loved this wig. So I wanted to try it out again in a natural color and I did a little something to it, but y'all gonna see that in the video. So if you guys want to hear my thoughts and opinions and a quick update on how the original wig is holding up, let's go ahead and jump right on into today's video. Your touch from your hands and your body It hurts so much to think of you as someone else Can't get enough when you're sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me, put your faith in me Put your love on me Clock and rewind, go back to that moment in time When you say you want me for life, was it all a lie? I gave my all to deserve ya, begging on my knees just to show ya You're the one I want and I love ya, no, 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 no lie I miss your touch from your hands and your body It hurts so much to think of you as someone else Sweet talking to me Now I'm talking sweet all by myself Put your arms around me Put your faith in me Put your love on me styling D and as y'all saw I gave her a little bit of a haircut <laughs> so originally she comes down to about my waist I'm six feet tall I would say she's probably about 20 22 inches long if I'm not mistaken I knew that since I was going to be purchasing this wig in a different color I was like this is my chance to cut it because I don't want to mess with the balayage color that I have because I just love it so much but I got it in a natural color because I wanted to try something different and because I love this wig I was like I'm gonna play around with my scissors and give her a little bit of a cut and I really love it she's kind of giving me like her vibes mm, and I love me some her y'all listen to me if you have not already purchased this wig you need to. I don't know what you're waiting for, but you need to. And if me and Nizzy cannot convince you, girl, you are thick-headed, okay? Because this wig is bomb. I decided to wear this one in a middle part because I did end up switching it to a side part in my first review. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna switch it up, do something different. So I wanted to go with a middle part and I used my hot comb just to push back the baby hairs and to give me that little like arch. You know what I'm saying? I love the arch around the part like y'all don't know on a middle part those little hairs right here just push back mm, I love it I love it so I wanted to do that with this style because I know I wanted to do like a clean hairline and showcase how pre-plucked and natural this hairline looks it is 
so so bomb i also really love how the knots are not super thick so if you wanted to go in and pluck they're very easy to pluck out i just love that about this hairline i think that they did a really good job i like the lace color it is a light brown it's easily blendable into my skin tone i did go in with my got to be glue free spray just to adhere this wig down because i knew i was gonna keep it on for the rest of the night and yeah that was pretty much it i added my powder right along the hairline and down the parting space and fluffed out the curls and here we are this is it <laughs> y'all already know that i love this wig however the cons that i mentioned in my first review still stand i do still wish that the curl started right at the root it would just help this wig look that much more natural really that's my only con about this wig the hair texture is bomb it's not a yakky texture but it is so super soft it's kind of like when they say that they're using premium synthetic fibers this is what that feels like this hair you guys i wish you could touch it it's so lightweight even though there's a lot of hair on this wig this density is full okay even though there is so much hair it's so lightweight and soft like oh it just feels like butter <laughs> Honestly, you guys, there's not much else that I can say about this wig. I love it. I'm obsessed. I also want to give you guys a really quick update as to how my first wig is holding up because I have had her for quite some time and I have worn her a lot. If y'all follow me on Instagram or if you follow me on TikTok because occasionally I be making TikToks. <laughs> she is like my TikTok wig. I love that wig so much. I'm going to show you guys right now what she's looking like and how she's holding up. So here she is, and she may look a little frizzy, and she is a little frizzy, but y'all, this is like my baby, okay? I wear this wig so often, it's insane. I still love the way the curls look, because right now they look super lived in, very like beachy and effortless, and I'm here for it. Here's a look at the ends. They don't even look that bad, y'all. Okay, right here in the... But this is on the underside of the wig. So this is what rubs up against my back. So that's why this area looks a little matted. But if you were walking behind me, that's what the ends look like. Okay, this is looking pretty, pretty good. Especially considering how often I wear this wig. I have put this wig in a bun. I have put it in ponytails. Girl, I've done a lot with this wig. Okay, she is bae. Typically, I wear that one as a side part with some juicy curls sticking out because that is one thing that I love about this wig is how the curls clump together like natural hair would. I just love it. Like, they're so juicy and bouncy. I'm obsessed. I really could go on and on and on, but y'all don't want to hear me ramble, do you? So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you head on over to Nizzy's Playhouse, show her some love and tell her that I sent you. Subscribe to her channel. She is bomb and you will love all the videos that she puts out. She's doing her thing and I'm so happy that she wanted to collaborate with me on this wig and I can't wait to see how she looks. I know she's going to look so bomb. So yeah, make sure you head on over to her channel, watch her video, comment down below and tell her Cassie sent you. And if you guys came from her channel welcome hey i hope you guys liked what you saw and if you did go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i will see you guys in my next video bye